in my hands I have a, a stack of canceled checks and um, they read Reverend Benjamin I. Richardson 835 Ann Street Columbus Ohio 43206 the date is 4-13-1967 and it's written out to Schottenstein's Schottenstein's store for $224 that's big money for 1967 I don't know what he bought but most likely it was something, something for the house or something for my mother and it's signed by my dad and I love my dad's penmanship. He had this impeccable script handwriting style. I tell you, on the days when we had the report cards and bring home report cards, there was no way that we could forge our father's signature because he was avidly involved in all of our PTA, the PTA association. He knew our, our teachers. He was an avid uh, pro advocate for education, higher education. He uh, would come up to our schools and speak with our teachers one-on-one. -on -one. And he was really concerned about our welfare and our continued, uh, like I said, he was really concerned about us. Daddy was a single parent at that. Uh, he was he, he was one of a kind. Uh, Schottenstein's, I can remember many a trip to Schottenstein's north and south and he would take us there and he would have he would have his tax exempt paperwork in his hand his ministerial credentials because you know he didn't pay taxes on well i don't know if that's even necessary to say we might cut that but what i want to express is that the relationships that he had in this city with people and the history and how much of the local heritage. I can see my father everywhere I go in this city. When I go down, I like driving through Bexley sometimes, just, you know, taking my time and the memories just come alive. You know, they come to life on Cassidy Avenue, Columbia Avenue, and um, Roosevelt Avenue. These were the streets that we grew up on as children and daddy's clientele were honeycomb in and throughout the community of Bexley and uh, the synagogues and uh, just you know daddy's name even Benjamin Benjamin Isaac is, is so symbolic and these, these these checks and I go you know Lord how did you permit such things to come into my hands you know, it just tells such a story. Here's a, here's a check that's council check has my mother and my father's name on it. Benjamin I Richardson and Michelle A Richardson, and it's dated 1964, and it's made out to Lazarus for fifteen dollars. And my mother she signed that Michelle Richardson. Michelle Richardson Baker Shoes, Michelle Richardson Sears and Company, Robot, um, Doctor, uh, here's another one with Daddy, that they have a joint bank account. And I look at these numbers, and I see here that Daddy had his own bank account. It might be too much information, but he had his own bank account, and then he had a joint account with my mother, because I'm looking at the routing numbers now. When you pay attention to things, right? This one was made out to Dr. E.M. Newkirk. And I wonder who. And look at my dad's signature. This dude was serious. He had a serious signature. You just could not mess with that. He just knew he was not a panty waist type of individual. He was a, a stand up, wear your belt kind of man. You know what I mean? Around his tr trousers. Uh, I, I just think it's uh, uh, tremendous. Well, what kind of legacy and, and the heritage that daddy um, left for us to um, be real reputable citizens in this earth and contributing uh, to this society in awesome ways. I'm holding um, a letter from a church called Church of Our Lord Jesus Christ 